Hi, I'm Susie the Strawberry. Want to learn about how I grow? Come on, let's go. I start out as a very small seed and I need sunlight and water and soil for my seed to start to grow and put roots into the ground. If I have all of these things, my seed will do what's called germinating. When my seed germinates, I'll send a stem and leaves up out of the ground. These leaves will continue to grow and get bigger to catch sunlight so I can make food for myself through photosynthesis. As I grow, I'll also produce little white blooms that have to be pollinated. Once the blooms are pollinated, green berries will start to grow and get bigger and turn red as they mature. When a strawberry turns fully red, it's fully mature and can be picked. An adult strawberry contains seeds that can then be planted back into the ground, starting the strawberry's life cycle all over again. Now that we learned about a strawberry's life cycle, let's learn about its supply chain. Strawberries can be grown in a field on a farm, in your garden at home, or even in a flower pot. They grow the best during the spring and summer in North Carolina, but how does a strawberry go from a farm to your home? Once strawberries turn fully mature and red, they can be harvested out of the field. The harvested strawberries are then placed on a truck and can be taken to either a grocery store, a farmer's market, to your school, or to a restaurant. And at any of these places, you can buy and eat strawberries. Sometimes you can even go to a you pick berry farm where you can pick the berries out of the field yourself. You can wash your strawberries once you get them and eat them fresh or take them home and prepare them in a dish. Well, I hope you had fun today and thank you for learning about me. Remember to complete the monthly wellness challenge and show us your favorite way to prepare and eat strawberries.